that was that. That was the Academy Awards. But hey, at least no slapping happened. It was the this Grammys. Year, right? <laughs> but at least but at least no slapping happened happened this year, right? That's Hello, right. Everybody. That you did a good job saving that joke, Tony. I know you got interrupted just then. <laughs> yeah, I got interrupted doing that joke, goddammit. But yeah, whatever. Yeah. You should slap Henry for that right now. Just walk up. Oh to my him. gosh. There's your slap, Henry. But anyways, hello there, everybody. This is 22 Tiger Dude here, and welcome to our annual Academy Awards predictions results where we all come together. Well, most of us come together to see how we did with our results. I literally told the others this before we start recording, but I do think this is the most interesting year for results. I will leave it at that. But it's been a lot of fun doing this. I'm looking forward to going through how many we got right and wrong with this whole ceremony. And uh, yeah, you know, without wasting any time, I'm going to go ahead and let everyone do their introductions before we get into the meat of this whole uh, night, starting off with Violet. Oh my gosh, hello, it's me. My camera is even worse than last time. Uh, yeah, so we are here. Uh, thank you for having me on. Uh, I'm very, very glad uh, to be here uh, for the results. <laughs> and again, like I mentioned in the uh, predictions, I haven't done this in like the three years. Uh, so I am really, really happy to uh, be here again. Uh, and uh, yeah, let's get into the results. Next one up we got is Brian Mendoza. Tully forgot to give me my coffee. It's supposed to be in this room. You know that? You had one job. You know that? You're, you're right. You're you're right. That's on me. That's on me, honestly. That's on me. But uh, in all seriousness, um, <laughs> this is going to be interesting. I don't know what to expect. And uh, oh, boy, I'm excited. <laughs> Next one up we got is Jackson Fulcher. I will not spoil too much of what happened, obviously, because we're about to get into it. But um, there's there's <laughs> there's at least one that's the most baffling, and I cannot wait to get to it. But this this was this was an interesting night with a with an okay host who did like the bare minimum, and uh, it was still the same length that usually is. The Oscars are back, baby. Woohoo! <laughs> so, so in other words, ten out of ten from Mr. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. So, you know what? Eleven out of ten. They did so good. That's eleven out of ten for the Oscars. Ninety uh, fifth Oscars. Next one up we got is Andrew Hayes, aka the Duck. I love that profile picture, by the way. Thank you. I, I it usually is a duck, but I had to I had to do something 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 different, you know, to commemorate so, something the, wholesome, the, right? Yes, yes, because this this was honestly uh, the best moment of the night. It was either this or uh, Jenny the Donkey. It was it was Jenny. It was still Jenny. <laughs> nah, nah. I, I, this this made me too happy. Jenny, Jenny, Donkey. Thank you. The donkey. The donkey did steal the show, though. I will say that. Yeah, the donkey. The donkey was great. Uh, the whole the donkey should be at every Oscars. Next one up we got is Henry Ewing. Well, another year and k pack still hasn't won anything. SMH. Wow. And I'm last one we my got. Head. <laughs> and last one we got here is Jordan Farrell. Oh, hey. Uh, don't mind uh, me, but uh, I'm actually here for the prediction results this time. I, I wasn't here last week because I was too busy. Uh, snorting cocaine and uh, hookers. With the bear? Did, did you did you do it with Elizabeth Banks and the bear? I think so, but it could be a guy in a suit. Who knows? Mm. Wait, is wow. Jordan the cocaine bear? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> but uh, I'm looking to actually be here at the prediction results uh, and actually make it on time. And yeah, my results are interesting. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Now, uh, Diego and Timothy, unfortunately, could not be here, but they are here with us in spirit. Yes. R.I.P. They're not dead. <laughs> Rest oh, man, I spent so much on their funeral. <laughs> oh, goodness. Uh, um, okay. And on that um, interesting note, let's get to our results, baby. Oh, boy. Okay. Oh, so... Yeah. 
So this one, I I knew I knew uh, this was a very tight race. This is one of the ones I am kicking myself for because I almost was gonna go with Brendan. I just thought it was gonna go to Austin because of all the talk, but it went to Brendan. But I will say it's the one category a category I am very happy I got wrong because I was really rooting for Brendan to win this. You know, especially after everything the poor guy has went through. Um, this is definitely a, a victory right here. So to you know the folks that predicted brendan congratulations obviously most of us got austin butler wrong though yes that's a big old x <laughs> maybe not the biggest one oh. now there's no x's with this one because we yeah. all got michelle yo right so congratulations oh. to her crazy it wasn't Andrew rice brother though another one we all got right uh congratulations big to Kay Hoi Kwan. uh very yes. awesome yes what a guy. My, I my very blessed, of- very wholesome. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Jackson, I know I know you're going to have your word. I know you're going to have your word, and I'll let you speak what you want to say right now. Uh, but I just want to say, um, I know she got the SAG, but aside from the SAG, like, I cannot lie. This is the one I was the most surprised by. And the funny thing is, I, I saw this moment happen while me and my mom and my grandma were driving on the way home from Ian at a Chinese restaurant. Uh, but yeah, go ahead. Any words y'all want to say before we move on on this? Violet, do you have? We all got. Yeah, I know you're a little passionate about this. Do you want to say something first? <laughs> um, yeah, I'll, I'll comment on this. Um, I, I just, I just want to say, uh, and and I always, I always hate like prefacing stuff like this because it comes off kind of like passive aggressive. But I love Jamie Lee Curtis. I think she is fantastic. Uh, Angela Bassett was fucking robbed. Uh, she is easily the best performance out of any of the amazing uh, women here nominated. Uh, and I said that with all due respect to all of them, but Angela Bassett was easily the best one. Um, and I also, and and I, I usually don't, don't say stuff like this, and I don't say this in like a way to like uh, degrade her as a person, but Jamie Lee Curtis only really won this because of her name. I, I, like I'm like 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 because Stephanie Sue is a better performance like like and just like I'm like she just is so that's just personally how I feel like I still love Jamie Lee Curtis like I still think that she's amazing <clears throat> but like I, like in terms of like the awards campaign like why wasn't Stephanie Sue like like at the front of this right like she's a better performance she has a bigger role in the movie um like she's she's in the mo- like Stephanie Sue is like in the most emotional scene like in the whole film and that's sort of, you know like just so acting and then and then also just Angela Bassett like I just I, I just I just think she should have won I, I think I think she's arguably that's the best performance in the entire MCU and I didn't love Black Panther Wakanda forever but like to me she was the best part about it so that, that that's all I have to say to say about it so yeah it it definitely like as soon as like Jamie Lee Curtis like what was it like an Instagram post or something like that where she was mm-hmm. like okay fine yes I want an Oscar it's ba- you know basically just laying the groundwork for like a legacy kind of like career achievement Oscar pretty much because yeah. like I'm I, like I'm trying to picture like people going back to watch this movie and like oh and, and Jamie Lee Curtis one supporting actress here let's let's see how good she is and then they see her it's like well, well she's funny I guess but I, I think she's fantastic in the movie but like I just yeah, my, but... my issue though is like Oscar worthy like the only I feel like such a main part of her campaign was oh it's Jamie Lee Curtis right. and, and in terms of just performance like it's Angela Bassett or Stephanie Sue or even fucking Carrie Condon honestly like like she was great in that movie and yeah. like like you know so yeah and also obviously Hong Cho was like great in the whale too but it's just yeah that, that's all the thoughts I really have on this. yeah I, I think yeah what what you said before is that like you know um she's not even the best person in her movie that is in the same category here. So yeah, yeah no, that about yeah, sums it up. Nothing against Jamie Lee, but no. definitely the weakest uh, of the five. The queen oh. of activia and trauma. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she runs the, the school I used to uh, be at last year. Oh, really? That's awesome. Again, again I love her. I just, yep, in terms yeah, of, yeah. She's in terms a cool of terms winning against those performances, I just, <clears throat> I just, I think she, other people should have won. Two hours later and, and it's, like, it's not completely her fault she won no and, and it's not her fault she won like, like, like <laughs> she's a great she's an awesome person like yeah. i don't like i just i don't know i just I'm, i just think in terms of an award it's like uh, right like, I, I, like the, I mean the one thing is like like i, I always take away from when i like to, i guess kind of help me not like just get over like certain because i i do feel passionately yeah. about the oscars and, and, and just movies in general like 
it's not the end all be all of like winning an Oscar or being nominated doesn't like define somebody's career. Like, like I, I always use this guy mm-hmm. as an example. John Goodman isn't less of an actor than yeah. somebody who's been nominated like a shit yeah. ton of times. No doubt, brother. I agree. I agree. So, I mean, I'm happy for Jamie, but um, yeah, no, it's. I agree with you guys. Okay, now um, next oh, one up, we got Damn his it. original score. Um, and uh, yeah, um, well, I knew it had a chance to be fair, but I didn't think it was gonna actually win it though. Uh, but yeah, we all got this one wrong. It was all quiet on the Western Front. <laughs> now, this one we all did get right. Uh, not two, not two from RRR, and I am so happy. Uh, the movie should have gotten more nominations, but I'm just happy that it won the only mm-hmm. thing it got nominated for. This is one of the ones I was so, so happy about tonight. RRR it, Supremacy. It, all is the way it was a great performance, too. Like, Oh, yeah. That was fun. And then, <clears throat> Thank goodness, one of the rare times in the last five years, not anything Disney related got recognition. It actually went to a different studio and it went to Netflix this year with Pinocchio. I'm very, very happy. Yeah, yeah. And I didn't like, cancel this one. I like Del Toro's speech. And um, of course, uh, most of us got the boy, the mole, the fox, and the horse right. Yay. I, didn't, I never saw any of these. Oh. It's, on, it's on Apple TV Plus, boy. Oh, shit. Now, this one, um, yeah, um, yeah, I thought maybe Le Pipil was going to get it, but like, hey, good right. job on an Irish goodbye. So, good job on Brian Henry and Violet for getting this one right. We can say at least one Irish thing won. <laughs> That's true. That's I thought true. Alfonso Coran would carry the it, but Irish I guess not. Man. Well, at least this one, uh, me and a majority of us got right. With the yeah, elephant them, whisperers. Them good damn elephants. All right. This one, a majority of us got right with Navalny for documentary feature. Right. Sure. Congrats. We tried. Love Diego. We, we tried. <laughs> <laughs> Diego ah, shaking damn, his head right now. <laughs> In heaven. But, but at least we all got this right for international feature, All Quiet on the Western Front. Yeah. I mean, I can't believe Maria Baklava didn't win Best Supporting Actress. Yeah, that's why. She wasn't nominated. Oh, man. <laughs> well, good job on Brian, uh, Jackson, and Jordan for getting the well right. I knew the well had a chance. I just thought they were going to go slightly more towards Elvis, but it went sure. to the well, and congratulations for it. Yeah. I feel like so much yeah. of the Brennan performance is in hand with that, so, you know. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. It of course, this one. I, of course, this one. I feel was pretty much yeah. a no-brainer. Uh, the way of water got this. So, congratulations to all of us. Mm-hmm. A very visually affecting film. That's true. Uh, Jackson, shit, and Andrew. <laughs> I am so sorry, but you both. You both were confident, and I respect that. So, don't be too sad about it. Uh, I but, am sad. Yeah, majority of us. Oh, oh. well, I'll, I'll give you a hug later on. Oh, nice. Oh, wait. Hold on. Let me bring oh, Andrew. Yeah. Big hey, Andrew. Andrew. This one. But yeah, all <clears throat> the Western Front won cinematography. So congrats to those that I'll, predicted. Big, big, I'll never trust a guild again. <laughs> I'll never trust Jackson Fulcher ever again. And of course, again. we all got film editing right. Everything everywhere all at once. Oh, my God. This one. Oh. So, Look so at freaking that. happy about Top oh, yeah. oh. Maverick for sound. Oh, man. This one and RRR and Brendan are like the three wins I was the most happy with tonight, honestly. Like, oh, thank goodness. Thank most goodness. satisfying we sound all, that of all right. time. Costume design, uh, which this is one of the ones I am kicking myself in the balls for because I was close to going uh-huh. on it forever. Um but yeah, good job to Henry, Violet, and Jordan for getting Wakanda Forever right. But the rest the of us, yeah, forever. Down, but the rest of us were down the pit with this one. Yeah, In retrospect, real. the sequel to the one that won before probably was the obvious one. <laughs> yeah. 
That's why I was close to going with that because of the first winning net. Right. Uh, this one, I, I, <laughs> oh um, no. Yeah, we, we 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 all got the big old X on us. All nine of us got the big old X on this. But production design did go to All Quiet on the Western yeah. Front. So congrats, Babylon Hive. We're done. <laughs> uh, I. I am so sorry, Jordan, but at least you tried, my man. But everyone else, yeah, we got everything everywhere right. Congratulations to the yeah. Daniels. That's right. Okay, Yay. nice. All of us got original screenplay right. So awesome. Everything everywhere Good. won that one. Nice. All right, adapted screenplay. Uh, a majority of us got this one right. So congrats. Yes, uh, and now, I put that bed on top going on that slot machine. <laughs> hey. Oh, hey. of course. Look at best that. picture. Everyone, everyone, you get all the money. You predict the best picture, right? Congrats. Look at us. Look at all of us. Oh, Let's bet this on Vegas next year, Tony. That's right. Let's go. Heck yeah. Oh my god. Hey, gambling just became legal in Massachusetts. So we'll oh, get, we'll, let's go to Massachusetts. Yeah. We're all going to Massachusetts. Let's uh, go to the basketball it's, game. It's legal. <laughs> okay, everyone. Now, this is where the most interesting part of the video comes in. Are the results. Um, oh, I, I am. Uh, I truly couldn't believe it. Um, <laughs> it's definitely the most interesting results. So, is there one ready? Yes, ready, ready. One, okay. Countdown. Three. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to count them from five. Okay. And, okay. Everyone, and, everyone, and everyone can join me on this if you want to. All right, so, cool. we're going to go. Five. five four. four three, three. Two. Two one, one, five. Oh shit! Oh. <laughs> oh, 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 oh my god! Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Five of you have to watch a bad movie. Congrats! By Henry. So, so first of all, I want to say um, congratulations to Henry. You won this year's uh, Academy Awards predictions. Um, Henry got first. <laughs> place with 18 right and five wrong second place is a three-way tie <laughs> between me jackson and violet <laughs> with 16 right and seven wrong and then last place um it's a five-way tie the first time ever this has happened in the history of this uh channel uh with andrew timothy brian diego and jordan getting 15 right and 18 Team, uh, and eight wrong, excuse me. We're going to and hell, last, Ryan. Uh, place. Um, so how's the prize work now? Um, wow, there's going to be a lot of watch parties for Life's in Jungle soon. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, goodness oh, no. gracious. Uh, oh, my God. God. Oh, I'm going to let Elvis get the best wow. of me. Welcome yeah. to the seventh circle, motherfucker. Yeah, right? it's, it's wild. But you know oh. what? Everyone played well regardless. Um, I, I think even with last place, the score isn't even that bad, to be honest with you. So, Better still. Than two. So bad. Better than one. <laughs> out of four. Oh, okay, <sighs> so everyone has pretty much agreed. We'll do the exact same thing that we did last year. I guess last year kind of worked ooh, ooh. out. So, nothing... So nothing that different from last year's, to be honest. But first place wins a Funko Pop of their choice. So that means, Henry, you get to choose whatever Funko Pop you would like to have. So congratulations, Henry. That is your trophy. And then second place. So there's three uh, people involved. So I don't know how we're going to do this, considering five people are in <laughs> final place. I guess we'll figure that out, Violet and Jackson. Yeah. Uh, you got to come to a oh, decision. Oh, maybe. maybe Maybe there could be a thing where one of us chooses one. Maybe the other one could choose like two for the other person, and then the other one could choose two for the other. I don't know. We'll wow, figure it out. Actually, I um, have an idea. What's up? Huh? What's up? How about we all choose one bad movie, and then the five people can choose from one of those movies? 
Ooh. Ooh. Oh, no. That's a good idea, actually. I like that. Okay. Right. That's a, I like that, Violet. We'll do that then. That <laughs> All works. All right. That works. And then final place. I am so sorry. I am so, so sorry. May have the Lord have mercy on your souls. Um, you watch a bad movie <laughs> picked by me, Jackson, and Violet. I'm so sorry. I'm going to be something um, so good for y'all. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, oh, oh. Bad L for me. I'm in the Red River Fish. So, now. can everyone agree why I was kind of speechless doing the results? No, oh, yeah. Because we all, five people tied for last place. Yeah, no. I, 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 I knew it was going to be close, but that's like hilarious. I. <laughs> oh, I love that. I, I'm even kind of laughing right now. It's like, oh my God. <laughs> I feel like the max usually is just like, oh, two of us will tie with each other, or maybe three. Yeah. So, like, having five is fucking crazy. I'll Jeez. double the cocaine since I'm the cocaine bear for this. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're Colin, right. I think I need to go back to my winning strategy, not paying attention to the Oscars. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just being random. That's like the one year I did good. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Then I start paying attention again, and this is what happens. Yeah. Come on, Andrew. Well, um, yeah, it's been fun. You know, as usual, these things come and go, but the experience of doing them is always a lot of fun and something that I'll always remember. I'm not going to forget this year's um, prediction <laughs> results. I can definitely say that right now. I'm not going to forget this anytime soon. Yeah. Um, but, of course, thank you to everyone that has participated in this year's uh, Academy Awards uh, predictions. Thank you to Timothy and Diego for joining us. Um, you all can follow their channels if you would like to. Um, and, of course, I'm going to go ahead and let everyone else do their outros one by one, starting off with Violet. Well, thank you for having me on. I'm extremely, extremely excited to pick a movie for all of you to watch. Oh. Uh, and uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, so thank you for having me on. Uh, it's always a privilege and honor to spend time with all of you amazing, beautiful people. And I hope all of you enjoyed watching. Uh, and if you would like to follow me more, I do have a YouTube channel. Uh, so yeah, that is that. Thank you. Freaking Brian. <laughs> uh, Brian, you look like you got things to say. Brian, Brian is so traumatized. He's gonna be stuck there for twenty five years. It's okay, Brian. Bri Bri Brian's like I'm in the dead zone. I'm in Brian. the dead zone. Consider oh. that as your punishment for showing me cats, Brian. That's true. <laughs> no, a toy thinks he did for begins to hear. Oh no! Literally, no. No, no, Brian. No. Brian, when they ask what year is this, they're talking about two thousand twenty three. Welcome to the rice fields, motherfucker. <laughs> but, uh, you can. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, no, we lost him. We're losing him. Very <laughs> soon. He's Pedro Pascal right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Get Elizabeth Olsen. Oh, I also, this is really random, but I love the joke that Jimmy Kimmel made being like, and now it's time for the first people that everyone is watching on HBO right now. Pedro Pascal. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good joke. You can follow me on my side. <laughs> you can't get through it. That's true. You, you got this, Brian. Pull strong, my boy. I believe in you. Pull strong. <laughs> You could follow me on my socials and everything. Oh, damn. Oh, shit, Brian, Brian, I, I see a fish in the percolator, dude. Oh, no. I drank it. <laughs> you want my bottle uh, of ketchup, Brian? You can follow me on my socials, and uh, this is the uh, first time I won't forget for a while. <laughs> so that's all I got to say. <laughs> Yeah. In other words, follow his channel and TikTok and all that. There you go. Yeah. Brian's a TikTok legend. Go follow him on there. No, absolutely. I'm crying. Well, um, um, yes. Thank you um, very much, Jackson Fulcher. Where can everyone find you? Uh, you can find me um, sitting at the local AMC staring deeply into the eyes of a cardboard raccoon. Um, you can also find me... Um, uh, setting off the sound cue to kick off the uh, people winning Oscars way too early. 
but you can also find me on my YouTube channel, which is just my name. You can follow me on Letterboxd, where I just, you know, do shit post reviews mostly. Um, yeah, that's about it. Uh, look forward to next year, as always. Yay! Next one up. Um, oh, and, 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 and thanks for having me on, Tony. That's it. Oh, you're welcome, Jackson. Anytime. Yeah, no problem. And, and of course, Henry, congratulations to this year's Academy Awards champion where can the people where can the people find the legend the champion right thank here? you sir i am on the letterbox and the youtube and the twitter and instagram and wherever else you want to find me whether it's lurking in the woods or whatever what the fuck who is that <laughs> oh no oh no they're coming for my funko pops that i don't have yet Is it Bigfoot? Oh, God. Oh, <laughs> oh. What is this, the exorcist? Yeah. Dude, it's a crossover between the exorcist and alien. It's right by David Gordon Green. Green. Honestly, okay, thank honestly, you honestly get Henry in the exorcist uh, reboot that David Gordon Green yes. is doing. It looked, it looked like Henry's about to give birth to a... Evil dies tonight. It looked like Henry's about to give birth to a Funko Pop Xenomorph. What about David Lynch directs David Lynch direct the exorcist? Thank you very much, uh Jordan Farrell. Where can everyone find you? Well, whenever I'm not uh, making movies or posting random shit on Letterbox or posting stuff on my new professional uh Twitter at J Jordan MJ Farrell, I'm hanging out with my ho my homeboy, uh um Leonardo DiCaprio. Uh but as soon as I hit twenty five, he's gonna ditch my ass. Oh, damn. Oh, oh. Uh, <laughs> wow. And the uh, last one is uh, Andrew Hayes, the duck. Um, I took a big fat L right in the keister. And, you know, that's just the price you pay. It's it's okay, Andrew. As, as, as long as the Celtics win it all, it's going to be okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah so actually so watch the bad movie, promise. Mm-hmm. Let's, let's let's all watch Celtic Pride. Okay. Uh, anyway, um, if I could leave you with this, don't play in the trains unless you get one. Or don't if, if you uh, ignore me right now. I don't know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> you don't know either. I was trying to say something smart, right. but no, I, I understood. I, I understood what you were trying to say. Yeah, the same I thing. did not. Oh, well, that's because, you know, <laughs> that's just because. I don't, I don't know why. Well, this is 22 Tiger Dude here with Violet, Brian, Jackson, Henry, Jordan, Andrew, and both Diego and Timothy and Spirit. And don't forget that we, no matter who wins or loses the Academy Awards predictions, will always have... Tiger power. Wow. Bitch. <laughs> <laughs>